Tonight, large amounts, and we mean large amounts of cocaine, marijuana, and stolen firearms off the streets thanks to a joint investigation led by Chatham Savannah counter narcotics teams. It's part of the largest single cocaine seizure our region has ever seen. Bradley Miller joins us live now with how authorities were able to pull off this bus and shares what this means for folks in our community. Riley. Four million dollars worth of cocaine and other drugs are off the streets thanks to Operation Snowplow. It started in 2017 and while it's gotten several suspected drug dealers off the streets, authorities are still searching for one man they say is armed and dangerous. We knew it was going to snow in Savannah with some cocaine, so Snowplow seemed like the, uh, the appropriate name for this investigation. Operation Snowplow is a collaborative effort by the Chatham Savannah Counter Narcotics Team, the DEA, the Chatham County Aviation Unit, as well as other local and federal agencies. The investigation started in early 2017 and found large amounts of drugs were coming to our area from Texas and California. The operation resulted in the region's single largest cocaine seizure, getting 25 kilograms of the drug off the streets. But those involved say the quantity is more than what it seems. You have uh, 25 kilograms of cocaine and this is essentially uh, uncut and this means that this is really at the very beginning stages. So people take this cocaine, wholesale it and really take a cocaine and, and depending on how much they stretch it uh, or cut it, it can almost be, be doubled or tripled the amount. Not only did the operation get cocaine off the streets, it also resulted in the seizure of 40 pounds of marijuana, 17 bottles of codeine, 5 ounces of MDMA, and 21 firearms, two of which were stolen. I think it's a huge win to the community as a whole. Uh, that includes uh, all residents of Chatham County because this operation spanned it through multiple local jurisdictions. It also put a number of criminals behind bars, something that CNT hopes sends a message to other drug dealers. Everyone has to watch and see when CNT is going to come kicking that door. Because if we can reach out and touch these individuals, we can reach out and touch anybody. While authorities are celebrating the success of this operation, their work isn't done yet, as one of the main guys is still on the run. Police are looking for 38-year-old Omar Fresh Jawan Griffin, and they're considering him armed and dangerous. He's described as a black male, 5 foot 8 inches tall, with short black hair and brown eyes. If you have any information on Griffin's whereabouts, you're asked to call the number on your screen. Callers remain anonymous and may qualify for a cash reward. Reporting live in Savannah, Riley Miller, WJCL 22 News.